Hello everybody, in this video we're going to be looking at border pane, H-box and V-box. Border pane is uh, one of the panes. It divides the screen into five sections. Top, bottom, left and center. So here we have a custom class called custom pane. It extends the stack pane and it has only one uh, child which is a label. It takes the string as the label text. Also, it sets the border color for this pane as the red and it has the padding as well. And we create five such custom panes by giving them these labels, this text. Let's run and see the result. This is the result of our program. So as you can see, we have five sections, top, bottom, right, left and center. Top, left, bottom, right is go are going to take as much space as they need to fit the content. For example, to fit the content of left, it means this much space. So that's enough for it. And it's gonna, it's gonna take such space. The right needs this much space. It's gonna take it, yeah? So center is gonna take all the remaining space. If left has more content to show, it's gonna push the center. Let's see how it happens in, in, in action. I'm just going to copy the left, paste it a couple of times, let's run again. This is the result of our program. You can see that left, left, left needs more space and it pushes the center, takes its space. The center shrinks, but all other remaining elements do not shrink. Alright, now let's look at HBox and VBox. These are very simple panes. HBox puts all the elements, all the nodes in a horizontal position. VBox puts them in vertical position. So we have two methods, get HBox and get VBox. Get HBox returns uh, an HBox that contains two elements, a button and a button. All right. The background color for this HBox is going to be gold and the, the horizontal spacing is going to be 15 and all the padding from all the sides is going to be 15 pixels. Get VBox returns the VBox. This VBox contains one label called Courses and uh, we have four more labels with the course uh, code and then we have a loop that runs through these courses and then we set the margin for each uh, label so we have uh, 15 pixel from the left it means the the label text is going to be moved by 15 pixels to the right and then we add this label into the VBox so in total VBox is going to contain five labels All right and then in the start method we have the pane into the pane we add one HBox to the top and VBox to the left we don't have to include right, bottom or center or any of the other sections. We can even use only one section if we need. All right, so let's run this. Okay, so this is the result. Yeah, we can see that this is an H box. 15 pixel padding here, 15 pixel padding here, 15 pixel padding here, 15 pixel uh, horizontal spacing. If I move this, yeah, you can see 15 pixel here as well. And if I move it more and more, buttons become less and less. Uh, I mean smaller and smaller. And this is a VBox. You can see 15 pixel padding here on the label and all of the labels are located uh, vertically. Alright, thank you guys for your attention. See you guys in the next video.